Alligator attacks on humans are very, very rare. Craig Berg is a reptile expert at the Milwaukee County Zoo. He says what happened in Orlando is tragic. The lake at Disney World is man-made, and protocol for gators was in place. When alligators were spotted, the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service would come and take the alligators and, you know, take them away. At least five have been removed since the boy disappeared. The zoo has Chinese alligators, smaller than the North American species in Florida. Berg fears the attack was mistaken identity. What probably occurred with uh, this incident was the child was young enough that the gator and splashing around uh, thought it might be a raccoon or something. It's also a time of year when alligators, usually afraid of humans, can be more aggressive. It's sort of the end of the breeding season and females have laid eggs and they have nests and they will guard their nests. And for anyone vacationing in Florida, Berg says, be aware of your surroundings. You need to really pay attention to any warning signs that might, might, might be out there. You know, there were warning signs in Orlando, no swimming allowed. And bottom line, he says, if you're in Florida near fresh water, you need to assume there could be alligators in there. Outside the Milwaukee County Zoo, Ben Hutchison, WISN 12 News. Hey.